whatever Robert here. What do you do when your lights go out? Well, it's high winds today, but it's 90 and humid out. And you got three dogs. Well, I got to take them outside, hose them, get all the loose water off of them, then take them back in, wait a half hour, then go back out and hose them off again. That way they stay nice and cold. High winds in my back alley took a tree down and knocked the wire down. So inside my house is steaming hot. But outside, the wind that's knocking trees down feels good. Now, we complained about them trees hitting all the wires for years. We've been here five plus years. The first storm hit, the tree fell, knocked our cable down, knocked our electric out. We, as neighbors, complained about this tree back here. Duquesne light will not cut it down or trim it. So every time it storms or rains and something falls on the wires, they have to come back out and we lose power. So yeah, it's one hot mother hunter here and the damn people ain't even gonna be here to turn the lights back on. A tree right here fell into the wires and there's a wire down right there and it took all our electric out. So let's see how long they take to fix that. Because you know, when it rains and storms, they can flip a switch and our lights are back on. But now there's high winds and the wires knocked down from the tree. Now it's a clean up and fix the wire. How long is that gonna take? My little rant because I'm hot. My dogs are miserable because it's hot and I gotta go back and forth and hose them off and hopefully I don't have a heat stroke. Whatever, Robert, whatever you do, stay the fuck cold because it's hot out.